hello guys welcome to today's video by trust stanley and this is a ts tech talk video so on today's video guys i'm going to show you how to contact youtube support if you're having any issue on your youtube application or either as a creator or as a user i'm going to show you the um these two different ways to contact youtube support and this ways actually guys is very effective for either a content creator or just a youtube um user or a fan so um let me go ahead and open youtube this is actually um important or very useful if you are both users so the first one i'm going to list is actually for youtube creators when i say youtube creators i mean people that upload the video you watch just like me um people that create video and they upload it to youtube and people watch it and then um the second people is actually the people that uses youtube so the first place if you want to want to contact youtube the first place you go to open the application click on the menu icon and then you are going to notice where it says help and feedback click on that when you click on that it's going to load up and show you some information now you notice this option where it says contact us now there is a, actually a particular reason why i have this particular feature even though you are a content creator you might not have this feature now the reason is because um this feature is only available for monetized users so this monetized user will have access to um either email the youtube support or chat with the youtube support so let me go ahead and show you guys live so i just clicked on contact right now and we are going to wait for it to load so now um it's it's going to load up and show you some information so go ahead and enter some random information and go ahead and put it and it's going to display some some things for you so let me enter the steps and you will get it so let's assume i'm trying to um, chat with youtube support because i do not have the green screen so this is what i'm going to say And then once I'm done, I'm going to click on next and it's going to load this information and says um, other creators questions, um, issue with artist image, yellow icon, access embedded, issue with release. And I'm just going to click on order because it's not displaying the related information. So I'm going to click on next. Now it's going to give you some information randomly, um, just telling you in case maybe you can easily find this, you can uh, um click on it and read exactly what he's saying but if you do not find the information yet and still want to chat the support click on next step and you are going to notice two different options right here this first option you can click on it and you send email to youtube support um i actually clicked um i actually clicked on it by mistake that's the reason why it brought me back here so i'm going to go ahead and enter in the same information while typing them out so i'm going to pause this video since i already showed you guys this all right guys so i actually mistake and right clicked on this i actually did not click on it but if i click on it it's actually going to load up and take me to this area where it's going to ask for my first name last name channel name and the reason why i want to contact and all of these stuffs so it's going to ask me all of these if i choose the email so whenever i leave this message and every information is always going to get back to me that is actually what this second option does which is the email but if i choose to chat with the support is going to load this up and ask for my channel url so um to enter my channel url i actually have to go back and if i go back it's actually going to affect this so but do not worry i have a way to actually get to that so i'm just going to get my channel url from this area so i'm just going to enter in youtube.com actually i know my channel url is supposed to be um youtube.com forward slash um life path because i'm currently on life path so do not worry anyway so click on this area go to your channel and wait for it to load click on this three dotted icon once more wait for it and it's supposed to show share icon but it's not displaying that i uh, do not worry anyway there are several ways to actually get that so this is my channel url and you can notice the um, link whenever i share this link somebody will be able to have access to it and also if i type in um youtube.com forward slash life path let me look at that 
youtube.com forward slash i can put at life part or just type in life part just like so it should bring me um to the life part of you um my channel actually it's supposed to load up let's wait for it all right so you can see i'm accurate this is my channel url what i just typed you can see the way it's displaying and it's going to always lead me to this particular area bringing me to my channel home page so let me go ahead and paste this in but if it actually or eventually rejects that uh we have to if you actually reject that, I will have to manually type it, but I'm very sure that is my channel URL. So let me wait for them. And uh, this always take less than three minutes. Um, I, I don't think it's up to three minutes, but we're going to wait and it should display in no time. So I want to leave this so that everybody is going to see how long it take. It says you are, um, you are number four in line. Just now we said one, no problem, let me wait. All right, guys so um finally i have been able to finally the chat is now live and this person is chatting with me so now um i can now start telling the person about the issue i'm having and how i want that to be fixed and all of those stuff so i'm not going to show you guys all of the charts because actually i have the green screen but i just want to let them know um that um the green screen always disappears after i clear my data so i want to know the reason but although i actually know the reason although i do not know the reason exactly but it just disappears and i want to know if it's actually a glitch and also to let them know if they will be able to fix this so that at least it will be good for everyone and then um you guys let me know if you have any question for me i can easily ask them but i don't think this is actually unique for everybody it might be different depending on whatever issue you are facing so um i'm just going to pause this video while i chat with this person and we are going to continue um later on soon all right guys so um that is done and that is how to chat with support i'm still chatting with the support anyway um if you notice right uh, my screenshot this area the chat is still on but let me go ahead and show you guys the second way to contact support um so if you are a different creator let's say you are not yet monetized just like this account um if you click on this area and go to the same place um the help and feedback area um you will you will only see the option to send a feedback now this option to send a feedback is also very effective when you click on get started you can type in your information just like i did but now the difference is you can just type in this information and send you will not be able to communicate with anybody or it's not as if you are sending any message so um click on this area and send the feedback to them and most of the time they don't get back to you but sometimes they will get back to you then um if you do not want that you want to communicate with them like chat with them just like i'm doing now another alternative is to just go over to tiktok application if you do not have tiktok go ahead and download tiktok application now when you have the tiktok application click on this plus icon right here click on the tweet although i do not actually need um any help from from the um youtube support but let me just leave this information just to let you guys know that you can easily communicate with youtube properly on twitter so now i'm going to say um Now, this is actually very important. Make sure that the um, people you are referring to should be um, YouTube support or Team YouTube. Now, this is actually the people that are most active. Now, there are other um, YouTube accounts right there which are also recommended. But guys, I will, all, I will, I will recommend you guys to only use this um, YouTube team or Team YouTube. They are actually very um, active on Twitter. 
So whenever you send them a message, let me say a maximum of five to 10 minutes, you are going to get a feedback. Notice I just sent this message 26 minutes ago. Now you are going to get a feedback very soon. So let me wait for the feedback because this video is already taking too long. Um, I'm actually going to get to the um, top and refresh. So let me wait for the feedback. Uh, once I get the feedback, I will continue this video, but also pay attention to the time I sent this message. Most times they take longer, but I'm very sure they will reply you within that day. So when they reply you, most of the time they can ask you to follow them and send them message in boss. That is actually, if it's something that have to be very private, you can send them message in boss and they will relate with you, communicate and help you sort things out. So let's wait for them to reply and we'll continue this video. Hello guys. So um, I actually slept up yesterday waiting for the reply from the support from YouTube. So um, I just clicked on the notification and see that they replied me nine hours ago, which means it was still um, between the period I sent the message. So let me click on this area and you notice they replied and ask when this was happening. So um, this was my message and I say, please, I want to know why the green screen on YouTube shop keep disappearing. And I left this message 11 hours ago and they replied nine hours later. I mean, they, re they replied two, um, three hours later because they replied um, nine hours ago when I saw it and this is 11 hours ago. Now, um, what I'm trying to say is they already replied and they actually want to know if this was working or the reason why it worked. So whenever I reply, they always give me my feedback until um, everything is resolved. So I'm going to tell them exactly why or when this happens. So you too should go ahead and do the same thing with whatever issue you are having. Make sure you reply to them properly and do it with a screenshot. All right, guys, so I just left a reply for them. And as always, they are still going to reply back as soon as they have received it. So I we keep replying and they keep replying until we get this issue solved or probably we have reached to a conclusion where I think um, it's accurate or they help me fix it. So whatever issue you are having on your YouTube or on your device, make sure you do this and you get it cleared. So guys, this is all I want to show you. If you have any question, please leave it on the comment section. Hopefully I'll be able to answer them. And if you like the video, don't forget to smash like and subscribe to the channel. Share the video with your friends that need this help and it's going to help them. And guys, I will see you on my next video. Please stay safe and peace.